When we are young, the lens inside our eye is flexible. As we change our focus from distance to near objects, the muscles inside the eye contract and relax to change the shape and focusing power of the lens. As we age, usually beginning in our 40s, the lens becomes less flexible and starts losing its ability to change its shape. As a result, it becomes more difficult to see at all distances, and we eventually become dependent on reading glasses for near vision. The medical term for this condition is called presbyopia. There have been several attempts to surgically restore a full range of vision for patients who are experiencing presbyopia with a laser vision correction technique called monovision. Monovision involves having one eye corrected for distance vision and the other eye corrected for near vision. The brain can adjust to seeing two images that are corrected to focus at different distances by suppressing or ignoring the image it does not want to see. But with the traditional monovision technique, there is often a blurred zone with compromised vision in the intermediate range between distance and near, which can make it difficult for some people to tolerate the procedure. A new laser vision technique using the Zeiss MEL-80 Eximer laser system is now available and called laser blended vision. It is based on the principles of refined traditional monovision in combination with a wavefront-based corneal shape optimization that virtually eliminates this blurry intermediate zone. With laser blended vision, one eye is primarily corrected for clear distance vision, leaving it only slightly blurred for near vision, while the other eye is corrected with only a slight shift towards near vision. This creates more depth of field within each eye and an intermediate region where the range of clear vision overlaps. This is called the blend zone. Creating a blended zone of vision means patients will have less disparity between the two eyes in contrast to what they would have had with the traditional monovision technique. Much less suppression is required by the brain and laser blended vision is much more tolerated by most patients. Published reports show that traditional monovision was only tolerated by approximately 60% of patients, while laser blended vision with the Zeiss MEL-80 Eximer laser system has been found to be tolerated by approximately 97% of patients.